for the squats with the heels elevated. You'll need small metallic plates, ideally can be two and a half, five or ten pounds, as long as they're about half an inch thick or so. If you don't have these, maybe a small piece of wood would do the trick as well. You'll place them inside the rack where your heels will go once you're in your squat position. Width is normal, just like a normal squat, therefore it's about hip width or maybe a little more. From there, you put the bar behind your back, back up, heels are on the plate but just barely the, the middle of my heel or even towards the end of my heel because I want the weight to be still on the toes as well. So it's as if I was on the floor with the four points of my feet pressing on the floor, except in this instance, uh, my heel's up, so I've got two points uh, on each foot pushing on the plate and the other two points on the front of the feet are pushing on the floor. So it's still evenly pushed. And then from here, come down and back up. Make sure your hips go below parallel if you can, keeping a neutral spine, just like a normal squat. And the reason we do this one is that Having the heels up a little bit will put more emphasis on the quads instead of hamstrings and glutes. Now hamstrings and glutes are still working, it's just an emphasis on quads and a variation from your typical squat.